Welcome back to the next episode of Gravity Rush 2. We return to Jerga Parallel, and is that gems? No, that's a big old floaty gem. I can't break that. Sup? Money moves the world. I know today's thanks day and all, but I'm just not in the mood to go present shopping. I need permission from the government to sneeze, and the garrison is always in my way. And the people who enforce the rules, oh, yeah. they're all taking bribes! <laughs> Maybe I should buy presents for the garrison soldiers. Seems like this city has its own share of problems. Yeah, there seems to be a pretty brutal military control over behind it all. Didn't we like fight to break Hexaville out of that at the end of Gravity Rush 1? Well, I guess we didn't fight to break it out of it, they ruined it themselves. Anyway, after getting that information point, we have a side mission to do, Diabolically Yours. Sounds good. I'm into it. Let's go. This is the start of a fresh stream of Gravity Rush 2, so um, I'm not that rusty. I went and ran a few uh, treasure hunts before starting this up, so I feel pretty good. Gonna run out of power soon, but I will arrive just in This place is fancy. Yo. Huh, that's Fee. And uh, Vogo. And the warp point. Fallen. Okay, what are you dorks up to? Remore. But Vogo, that's... <laughs> Just keep your mouth shut. <sighs> Arguing about work? He keeps going on and on about adding more security. Uh... Well, yeah, sure. Our competitors like to hassle us from time to time. I can't justify the expenditures. Really? Vogo, if they were just hassling us, I wouldn't be arguing. You've got to see our competitors are growing more and more cutthroat. Better security force would bleed my wallet dry! There must be a better way. Innovate! Use your mind, not money. Not my money. Uh -huh. Maybe you should look at why you have so many enemies in the first place. Change things. Make sunshipping a respectable business, you know? You now you're studying it on me! Uh Wait, I've got an idea. I can help. Uh We're doing just fine without you. See. Thank you for the offer, Cat. We can use all the help we can get. One gravity shifter is worth a hundred security guards. <laughs> Right? I'll even help you this once for free. See, Alvi. And that's your favorite price, Vogo. How about it? <laughs> Fine, do whatever you want, as long as it doesn't cost me anything. Chat. We've got a deal then. You'll help me protect Sun Shipping Investments. Oh, yep, yeah, leave it to me. Why aren't you being kind, Cat? She's gonna get paid for this one way or another. She's got a plan, I can tell. Alright, so what's poppin'? What's happening? Tell me the haps. What's doing? Is this what we're delivering? Yep, yeah, I pulled one over on the competition and got an exclusive delivery contract. <sighs> no wonder everyone's out to get Bogo. Oh? Wait, where's your crew? See. I assigned them to another job. Huh? Wait, so I'm the only security on this? Mm. I hope I'm gonna be alright. Vogo has a lot of enemies. Okay. If you're done chatting, you've got work to do. Look up! So I gotta gravity kick someone out of the sky? That's the president of our biggest rival. You better stop this shipment or I'll have to stop it for you. Vogo! You cost us a huge contract with all your connivery. Now it's time for you to pay! He looks angry. What did you do to him? I just had a little fun with him before he's meeting with a client. You see, I covered his chair with a strong glue so he couldn't make the appointment. You, what? I should have known what I was getting into when I agreed to help you. Shipping is a tough business. You've got to be willing to do what it takes to survive. No one likes you, Vogo! Heck, all you can get for protection is one scrawny little girl. Soldiers, get them! Scrawny, you say? I like how these soldiers have uh, nevy points as well. No, they don't. Oh, we employed a bunch of ex-garrison soldiers for mercenaries. Oh. We might be in for a little trouble. Vogo, take the helm. Me? Me? Cat, you take the foredeck, I'll take the back. Spinella. With you helping, we just might be able to handle this. It's fine. Sup, boys? Man, I immediately tried to kick them before it even loaded in. As the transport ship gets attacked or boarded by soldiers, the takeover rate will rise. When the takeover is complete, the transport ship will be seized and the mission failed. Whoa there! Hey there, buddy. 
stop that. Alright, who's next? Looks like you're taking the back, so I'm gonna... Never mind, I'm gonna deal with these guys. I like that Fee is just... Oh no, Fee is now contributing. Wow, that double takedown is pretty strong. Alright, looks like we got some trouble back here. I'm gonna get in on that. Man, they get invincibility hitboxes for way too long. Next. What do you mean the takeover rate is still up? Who did this? Chicago. Who is doing these things? Well, killed that dude. Next! I can grab people! Alright, now what? Next! What's happening here? Not one of those ships. I am doing the best I can here. I don't know what's going wrong and why the takeover rate keeps increasing. Okay, we got him. The beers with just two people? How is that possible? <laughs> <laughs> that was easy peasy. We're pretty cool, Fee. Lemore. Too easy. They'll be back with reinforcements. Full speed ahead. We need to make this delivery as soon as possible. If we can just reach the harbor, they won't be able to lay a hand on us. Huh? Yeah. Is that the sound of an engine? Wait, a lot of engines! They're coming from below us. Great. Great! Great! Vogo! I'm really upset with you right now. We're surrounded. We knew Vogo would put up a fight. So we had another unit on standby for just such an occasion. Vogo! Vogo! We're not letting you get away with this! You don't know when to give up, do you? Vogo has made some serious enemies. Cat. Cat, take out the troops from the first landing craft. What about this boat? Oh. Leave it to me. Okay. Good luck, Fee! First landing craft, huh? Alright. Next! Surprise! Oh, these flying kicks are sweet. Sup! Hey, boys! Boop! Next. Man, these gravity kicks from above are pretty mean. Mercenaries dealt with. <laughs> yeah, I saw about the Square Avengers game earlier. I wonder what it's going to be like. They didn't really show anything of it, so we have to wait and see. We made it through! Let's run for it! I know it. It's not gonna be that easy. Oh, now what? <laughs> More of them?! <laughs> I don't care how tough you two are! We'll put you down with sheer numbers! Why did they find so many mercenaries for hire? <laughs> I had a lot of help from Vogo's enemies! He has a lot of them! 
they were willing to help as soon as I told them I'd take care of you. Father! Fogo, this is all your fault! <sighs> and Fee, how can you help Fogo knowing what he's like? Oh. I know, but he is my brother. Guess you can't pick your family. Yeah. Alright, I'll help, but only because of Fee. Fee and I are a good team. Okay, what have I got to kick? Where am I kicking? Oh, that's a giant robot. Sick. No, no, aim at the robot! Alright, we're cool. That was a good robot takedown. Hey there! See Fee just kick that dude off the ledge? That was sick! Awesome, Fee! That was savage. I loved it. Alright, next. Fee, you've got my back? Hey, boys. I'm gonna have to have some of you come with me. These guns. I'm attacking with guns, but not the way you'd think. This is mean. I'm doing mean things here, but I am enjoying it, so it's okay. Another robot! God. Hey, come here with me. I wonder if I can break this thing by throwing people at it. No. Gotta kick it. Come here. Whoa there. Alright, the people are really easy to take out at least. Alright, one down. Okay, I can probably do like a power throw now. Okay, I can try to do a power throw. It doesn't seem to want me to. There it goes. Wow, they are really not pulling any punches here, huh? Alright, well, the throwing appears to be the strongest way to do this, so... Next! No, oh, there's next. Alright. Anyone else want to complain? How, how, how did they defeat all those soldiers? Fall back! Vogo, you may have survived today, but we will get you. Whew! We did it. Thank you for helping us pull off this delivery, cat. <laughs> You're very welcome, Fee. Yeah, Fee's cool. Virgo isn't. Ooh. Virgo, Virgo, what took you so long? My sincerest Oh, my sincerest apologies, but we hit a bit of a snag on the way in. We've made the delivery safe and sound. I know, everything was already delivered as promised. Ah? Huh? Your people dropped the stuff off at my mansion a little while ago. All that's left is signing the receipt. Ha, <laughs> Fee, you clever boy. Ow! What? But the delivery is sitting over there on the ship, isn't it? The crate's are empty. Empty? As in empty? I asked our staff to make the delivery. I figured that'd be safe if we kept the other shippers distracted. So we were just bait? It worked. They are also focused on attacking us. They didn't notice our people making the delivery. Foko, were you in on this? In as much as he told me to use my mind, not his money. Right, I knew what you were up to all along. That's my brother. 
Something tells me he didn't have a clue what was going on. Some brother. But he is Fee's family. Fee. Well, I guess everything worked out in the end. Cool, now pay me. Side mission, diabolically yours complete. Good job. Obtain sun shipping crate photo item. Photo items are si silly things to obtain, but I'm not going to complain. Alright, I see some gems right ahead of me, and where are we? I am not sure where we are relative to anywhere else. We'll check the map as soon as I have these gems. This is beautiful. This is beautiful, where are we? Alright, we've moved over to Le Havina. So... We are done done with Le Kolmosna? We are indeed. Le Havina over here is where the next main mission is. However, down here in Le Elgona, there's still a side quest and some talkings. So we're going to head there soon. But let's explore Le Havina for a bit first, because this is beautiful. I mean, I know it's a uh, fat of the rich comes off of the blood of the poor, but it still looks good. Dog! Is that dog carrying your golf No. How did I think that dog was carrying a golf club? What did I see that made me believe that? Oh. Hola. Hey, Mr. Reporter! Did you bring that hammer down to room doing yet? Uh. Well, well, I was, but you see, the editor, he decided... Huh? D decided what? Uh. He decided not to run the article. You could say he squashed it. <laughs> How could he? Can't you do anything to get it in print? Turns out my mighty pen wasn't mighty enough to stand up to the power of money. You need more than words to get the truth out to the world. But justice always finds a way. I'll do whatever it takes to see it does. Good luck. Wow. That sucks. That sucks real bad. I'm real mad about that. Let's set a marker here so we don't forget this is where we're going next. I believe this is probably... Yeah. Yeah, that's, that area is down in the slums. Man, this game is absolutely beautiful, I have to say. Like, it is stunning how good Gravity Rush 2 looks. Ah, I missed a gem up here. Not anymore. I see Vogo and Fee have shoved off somewhere. Yo! I am mad about how good this place looks. Let's head downtown. Get that information spot and check out what's the deal with that side quest. Heading downtown. Falling fast. Falling faster. It's good. I need to get a warp manhole down here. How did I end up in Lake Holmosner again? Okay, so what I've determined is that these four sections, they're not so much like spaced out so much as they are just directly above one another. You know, I'm gonna look for a warp manhole when I'm down here because I am sick of having to go up and down. Through the clouds. And there's my information point. I can see it now. I can see those gems. Oh, big gem. Delicious. Feed me. Another big gem. Nice. Hey, buying trouble. Thanks for kicking the garrison out for us. I hate to have to say this. But you brought some trouble down doing that. We'll need to lay low for a while. Sui. Okay, I'll be careful. Oh, cat. Alright. 
Let's go relatively on foot to see if I can't spy myself a uh, warp manhole. But I am also going to try and get some gems. Obviously not all the gems, but we can try and get some. As we get there it is. Nope, that's a side quest. Never mind. Okay, there's going to be a warp around down... Ow! A warp around down here somewhere. And I do require it. Up. Because I'm sick of having to go up and down here. Hey, pigs! Okay, warp. Show me the warp. Hello? Some things don't change. Uh, it's not easy making a living. Just once I'd like to give my kids a square meal and send in a bed full. If it weren't for the angry centipede, we'd have nothing. And where I dropped off didn't seem to make much of a dent in the problem. Yeah, I imagine it wouldn't. I imagine it's also like pretty callous picking up all the floating ore around here. But, I mean, if these people are so desperate, I figure they would have gotten like such simple things as what's on top of the buildings. Okay. If I were gonna, gonna guess where a warp would be, I would put it somewhere around the middle of the map. So I'm gonna head to the middle and try and scout it out. It's pretty important we get that warp, so I don't have to keep doing this ridiculous... Oh god, are those water catchers that catch the water dripping down from above? Oh, that is sick. Like, sick is in the bad one. I've been using sick positively a lot. That sick is in the bad kind. But they have to do that? That's... that's nasty. Alright, give me the warp. I know it's around down here somewhere. Crawl around down here. Just can't see me. As I'm held aloft by the powers of gravitation. Hmm. It's around here somewhere. Eyes open. I'm gonna find it. Somewhere around here, there is a warp manhole. And that will allow me to Mario my way back here in future. So I seem to be having difficulty locating it. Hmm. Maybe I'll be lucky and it'll show up in this side quest. Let's get started. So many gems to collect. Sup, centipedes? The spoils of war. Hey, now that we're on the same side, you mind if I ask a favor? We're on a mission to steal some supplies from the garrison. Could you help us out? If you can't, let's just pretend we never talked. It's just the kids in Elgona are hungry and need those supplies. Uh, I know stealing's wrong, but I'll help. It's for the kids. Uh, Great, I'll fill you in once we set off. Hashtag for the kids. Alright, load us in. All right, how are we doing this? <laughs> we need these supplies from Fort B Bismalia. What do you need me to do? <laughs> While the others are distracting their soldiers, we need you to sneak in. If you can find the supply crates and toss them overboard, we'll handle the rest. See? We'll fill you in over the radio. Here, take it. Thank you. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Okay. Black Cat, commence operation. Black Cat, is that supposed to be my code name? Well, if we're doing a mission as the Black Cat, I think that means one and only thing. As soon as I gain control. Cool. Centipede here, come in Black Cat. Black Cat here, I have infiltrated the Bis Bismalia. Roger that, begin the operation. If you find a supply crate, just toss it over the edge. Any side will work. As long as it goes overboard, we can grab it. Got it. Just be careful not to get spotted by the guards. If you go flying around in the air, you'll draw too much attention. Okay, I'll be careful. Okay, without being seen by the soldiers, grab supply crates and throw them off the Bismalia. To maintain your cover, your stasis field range will be limited, so get close to the crate before trying to grab it in a stasis field. If you're seen or heard by soldiers, their alert level rises. Run away and hide until it drops back down. If the alert level reaches its maximum, you'll be spotted. Quickly dispatch the guard before they can sound the alarm. Knock out too many guards and the patrols will increase. Alright. Alright. 
Black Cat on the job. Alright, what's the correct way to aim, you think? Oh, definitely that way. Oh, I broke some other ones. I only got one crate out of that? I was way too hasty on that. That was a bad loss on my part. Alright, let's sneak around and see what we can find. Any supply crates out here? Uh, these aren't marked like supply crates would be, so I'm going to assume they're not. Here's some. Okay, let's just do it like this. Yeah, I definitely wasted my freebies. And eyes open for soldiers, of course. Hey, hey, you didn't see anything. No alert level. Yeah, this guy didn't see a thing. And now he's forgotten I exist. Like any good Metal Gear level guard will. I guess these, this is the sky the genome soldiers went to after getting knocked out by any of the snakes, really. Alright, let's sneak around. Whoa there! Okay, never mind. Oh, spotted. Never mind. Okay, cool. Thanks. Good job, me. Okay, well, at least that lets me get these crates back. That said, I think this mission's gonna be a pretty sizable one. So let's wrap this episode up here and we'll continue the next one in Crate Collection. Thank you all for watching. Have a wonderful day. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.